Hey everyone, real quick, I wanna thank the sponsor for today's video. Whew, being keeps, keeps, that's right. Helping men keep their hair, guys. So what you might not know is that two out of three men are gonna experience some form of male pattern balding in their lifetime, guys. And I tell you what, having barbers carve artificial lines in my head sometimes gets me a little queer for the longevity. But of course, with hair loss, the key is being preventative, proactive, guys. So you need to start acting now. So with keeps, you can avoid awkward doctor's visits, you can avoid awkward pharmacy visits, you can get treated directly from your home. They'll send you medications every three months, so there's no in-person doctor's appointments required at all. And plus, I mean, do you really want to go to the doctor's office right now? And guys, these are the only two FDA-approved products for hair loss. So you're getting the best price for these high-quality generic products. So even if you've tried these products before, you've never gotten them at this price. So with that, guys, hair. Head over to keeps.com forward slash Joel Hansen. That is right. Keeps, K-E-E-P-S dot com forward slash J-O-E-L-H-A-N-S-E-N. And that is to say 50% off your first order. Yes, that is right. So go to keeps.com forward slash Joel Hansen, guys. Use that link right now. Go save 50% and then let's get to the rest of the video. Hey everyone, Joel Hansen here. Today we are at Burgers and Blues in Jackson, Mississippi to do their whammy burger challenge as seen on the Man vs. Food show. So this is a very famous challenge. Um, not only known because of the Man vs. Food show, but also because it's had some ridiculous jackpot cash prize in the past. Randy Santel has won like 1500 bucks from this. Uh, Jeff Esper won similar, like 1500 bucks. Um, so yeah, pretty cool. The overall record is like three minutes now. It's basically untouchable. Uh, Mr. Jeff Esper, congratulations. Um, that being said, right now the jackpot's only like 100 bucks anyway. So yeah, I'm just, you know, anyway, we just went to a buffet, so I'm just gonna finish off with this challenge. Uh, my eating for the day, that's for sure. But we have 30 minutes to actually complete the challenge. You don't have to beat the record, you just won't get the jackpot. Like I said, it's only 100 bucks right now. But anyway, so yeah, we're gonna have uh, 30 minutes to eat the burger. It contains uh, three pounds of beef, three big patties, um, which they used to allow you getting cooked like medium, and medium rare and rare, but they actually stopped doing that because they said it's easier. Um, so now you have to get them cooked like medium well well. Uh, but yeah, anyway, fair enough. Um, so yeah, then oh, there's a whole bunch of fries and a milkshake, 30 minutes. So if we do that, we get a meal for free. If not, we gotta pay 50 bucks. So let's go on in and see what we can do. It should be fun. Um, and yeah, eat some burgers. Jackson, Mississippi, super excited. This is like I said, a very well-known challenge. So Let's eat some food. Hi everyone, so here we are with the whammy challenge. So definitely a big burger, a bit of fries, um, a milkshake. Um, again, a couple times. I know Randy Santel did this in like 15 minutes. Uh, Molly did it at five, Jeff did it in like three. Um, again, I'm not chasing any records today. I don't know about this girl right here. I'm All right, so yeah, anyway, 30 minutes, but we'll get started. So um, yeah, milkshake, burger, fries. Um, so burger, uh, time starts when we dig into it basically. Cool. So how we start, we'll say the count of five, four, three, two, and one. Let's get going. Thank you. Definitely a big burger. So at one pound burger patties, loads of veggies and stuff. I just want a tasty burger. Hey everyone, welcome to today's video where today we're at Burgers and Blues in Jackson, Mississippi. Guys, super excited to be here in Mississippi, specifically Jackson. So again, doing the famous Whammy Burger Challenge. So as I mentioned guys, it had notoriety from the Man vs. Food Show, which is pretty cool. It also had a lot of notoriety for some big, big, big cash prizes. That's how I found out about it. Um, Randy Santel did it, won something like 14 or 1500 bucks, so that's super cool. Congratulations, Randy. And unfortunately, though, at the moment, there is no big cash prize. Um, there was a $100 jackpot, as we mentioned. I believe that's where it starts. That's the base starting point. Um, but Mr. Jeff Esper, Jeff Esper recently just got the uh, big jackpot um, and set a crazy record. Uh, it's a lot of food to eat in, like, you know, a bit over three minutes. So kudos to him. He's an absolute beast. Um, but yeah, so let's talk about the actual challenge itself. So overall, it was a pretty solid burger. I would say I am a little disappointed that you are only allowed to get it basically well done at the moment. Um, if you could get it like a medium or a medium rare, in my opinion, it would be uh, quality wise quite a bit better. Lots of layers, lots of healthy vegetables. It was just kind of the type of burger, the type of patty, um, like the way they made it that uh, it would have just it would have made a little bit more enjoyable for myself, but hey, it's all preference. I mean, overall, it was still a very uh, good tasting burger. I really liked the seasoning they put on it. It was kind of like they used a bit of like a steak spice in the burger patties. Um, There's also absolutely no shortage of vegetables. Um, definitely a lot of vegetables. Basically, it's, it's kind of like three whole burgers stacked on top of each other. So it's like bun, veggies, meat, uh, and cheese, 
bun, veggies, meat, and cheese. Bun, veggies, meat, and cheese repeat. So three times. Um, and yeah, the very big burger patties as well. I mean, them being a whole pound per patty. But again, they were quite thin. Um, they cooked them on a grill. Um, or sorry, like a like a flat top, like a like a griddle, not like a grill, not like a wood fired grill, or not a you know not a charcoal grill, but more like a like a flat top. You know what I'm saying? Stainless steel, that kind of thing, um, that kind of a grill. Um, so again, just you know, with that being said, um, it was pretty solid though. I have no complaints. Um, they do a hand cut fry there, so they cut their own fries, um, which were very nice as well. And again, lots of fiber with the burger. And that's a good thing. So about three minutes in, we have 27 minutes left. I'm pretty much done my beef. Then we just got buns and lots of veggies. Brain's doing well. So yeah, let's do this. The challenge also came with a milkshake, um, which is usually a nice addition uh, to kind of top it off. You had uh, three choices, either vanilla, strawberry, chocolate. I went with vanilla. Um, that's kind of my preference out of those three. And Raina went with a strawberry. Um, it's pretty cool. They uh, The way they did the milkshakes is in that little mason jar. You can see it in between me and Raina, um, my vanilla one. And they put like an icing around the rim to kind of give it a little bit of color. And then a whipped cream cherry on top. Um, mine is the icing's white. You can't see it as well, like the white on white. But for Raina's, um, if you when she ever starts drinking it, you'll notice it's like a different shade of pink or red. Um, so hers is a little bit more uh, distinguishable to see the two differences um, between the icing and or the actual shake itself. Lots of veggies. Of course, got the bar stuff on standby, guys. <laughs> the record before Jeff's was held by uh, Molly uh, Schuyler. Um, and she was about five minutes something seconds, and a lot of people tried to beat that one. Um, now I will say that even five minutes and some is an absolute beast time. Um, and that record held for quite a few years, and hence the record, and like I said, a lot of people tried it, and hence the jackpot got up to $1,400 or $1,500 to when Jeff came in and got it. Um, when it was at about five-ish minutes, it was very high on my list. And actually, so uh, my friend Scott and I had plans to do a Southern United States tour um, or trip in May. Um, and like we had it all planned, but of course, due to the world situation pandemic, it all got canceled. Um, but that Whammy Burger Challenge was on our list. And at five-ish minutes, I definitely really wanted to give it a true run. I wanted to give it my all and try to, of course, win 1500 bucks. Like that's a serious jackpot. Um, you know, even if it's a very difficult uh, challenge. All right, you guys, get the five minute mark. Five minutes? It's about five minutes in. I'm just on the bun, the fries, the milkshake. Arena is making my way through the burger as well. The new record being three ish minutes and the uh, you know $100 jackpot prize at that. I really didn't think I had a chance at three minutes. I really don't think I could do it. Um, five, five and a half or whatever Molly did it, I might have a chance. Um, but yeah, like I said, guys, crazy records, crazy times, crazy, crazy eaters. Huge kudos to both of them. Um, the challenge again, 45 minutes if you don't complete it. But if you do, would well, you have a full 30 minutes? Um, you get a, the meal for free and a t-shirt. The success rate was about 23 winners out of 240, and there was 244 losers. So about 23 um, winners out of 267 attempts, essentially. So just a bit less than, uh, like probably that's probably like a nine. I'm just doing math top of my head. Eight to nine percent uh, success rate. So it's not horrible, horrible, but it's definitely you know not a very very high success rate. Um, so ultimately just kind of showing to the uh, difficulty of the challenge overall. Um, like I said, I mean, it is quite a bit of food. I would estimate, I don't know, I mean, the burger is like six pounds, I guess, probably six pounds, maybe five. It's about eight minutes in, fries are definitely hand cut. Nicely cooked, ready to well. Just got a few left. Then the milkshakes, we're going for that win. We were uh, actually coming from a southern uh, buffet. We went to a southern buffet this morning, went to a place um, in Jackson that I really wanted to try out, is on my must try list. So I was already definitely quite full from that. Um, so, you know, I knew this wasn't going to be a uh, excellent performance from myself. But of course, like I said, there it wasn't, uh, I don't think I could have beat the record if I tried. 
and the, of course the standing $1,500 jackpot no longer existed. But well, everybody, I think that's all the information I have to give you today, so that will let you get to the rest of the video. I hope you enjoy. Ultimately, let's hopefully you can fully get some wins, and let's see what happens. All right, you guys, are basically 10 minutes. Thank you. Like two, two, two. This guy looks like he hasn't eaten in like a month. <laughs> <laughs> I got one guy. He's doing great. She just like, I got this. Done and done. Shop about 11 minutes, 20 seconds ish. Um, so yeah, definitely a nice taste of burger. Milkshake was actually very, very nice. Very good taste of milkshake. Very creamy. Very banana. I like it. <laughs> excuse me. We're gonna do it while well. Finish up the burger. Just add some. Excuse me. Some buns. There's all that air. Um, a few fries, and then she's pretty much done her milkshake as well. So also going for that win. Probably about 28, 27 minutes left for her. So we'll chew it on in. It's right to finishes up. Exactly all the oh yeah, what am I saying? Yeah. <laughs> it's only 30 minutes. Sorry guys. Only uh only about 17, 18 minutes left. There you go, that's the right one. Food's getting to me guys, food's getting to me. Food combo. Man. Yeah yeah yeah. Food combo, yes, for you. No, that's funny. Yeah, not 40 minutes, 30 minutes. <laughs> uh, Did you do it? Look at that clean plate, man. When's the last time you ate? Like, honestly? <laughs> uh, like two hours ago. <laughs> you had the chip bump, it seems like you had it in the bump. Good stuff. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. All right. Good All right. stuff. So that'll be 25 winners out of 269 <laughs> attempts. My math, my math is right that time. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh -huh. Yeah, still alive and breathing. Doing pretty well, right? No complaints. For those of you who are watching, you can check us out on YouTube. 
My name is Joel Hansen, J-O-E-L, space H-A-N-S-E-N, or you can look up model versus food, spin on man versus food. And then you can look up Reina, Reina Wong, R-A-I-N-A, H-U-A-N-G. You're welcome. <laughs> and 18 minutes in, ran it down to about a bun and then just a few fries. Finished. Minutes and 30 seconds. Woo! All right, so Raina finished up. Very nice challenge, really good size. Again, memorable challenge, not only because it can have some crazy cash jackpots, but it's also members food. So everybody, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Uh, of course, if you're ever in the Jackson, Mississippi area, be sure to check out Burgers and Blues. What more can you ask for when you're in Mississippi? So yeah, till next time everybody, stay happy, healthy, hungry, happy eating, don't do what we do, but yeah, if you want to come and try some food, come try some food. And that, just have a lovely day. And here's a t-shirt, everybody. Definitely pretty cool. Everyone, thank you so much for watching today's video. I really appreciate it. If you click my face right here, you can subscribe. Yes, that's right, click my face, subscribe, guys. It helps me out, helps you out, then you don't miss an upload, and hopefully I can meet you when I come to your city. Also, click a video right here. I specifically pick two videos, yes, that's right, two videos specifically for you right here. So click a video right now, get that going, and it's gonna end, so click one quick. Let's go, let's go, and have a great day.